Okay, I must be missing something. There's gotta be more on the island that I can go do. Yeah, there's like this whole path down here. Harbor, we can go up and see the strange lights. Okay, let's go over this way. Oh, that's Hey, neat. look, a full moon. <laughs> Looks like Meathook finally got himself a bridge. Personally, I kind of miss the old pulley and poultry method. <laughs> it's locked. Knock, knock. Who's there? Anybody home? No, go away. Um... But there's supposed to be a wax show today. No, there isn't. Yes, there is. No, there isn't. The sign out here says there is. Uh, yeah, that. Well, it's cancelled. <laughs> it's okay. It's me. Me who? Guybrush Threepwood, mighty pirate. <laughs> nice try. Guybrush and Elaine are dead. I know why you're here, and you can't have it. But I am what are you brush. talking about? Stop pretending, you greedy old man. You think you can just buy up the whole island just because you can insult people? Well, think again. You can't take my house away from me if you can't get in. I knew I shouldn't have fixed that bridge. Then who are you? Uh, no one. There's no one here. When do you expect someone to be home? Later. Much later. Finish running your wife's errands first. There's nobody home. Now go away. Okay, I'll come back later. Hmm. All right, so let's go down to the shoreline then. So that's literally then the only places we have. This inner tube looks as though it's been subjected to unspeakable stresses. Okay. I'm Guybrush Marl Threepwood. And I need a ship. How nice for you. And just what do you want me to do about it? That's what I was gonna say, yes. Are you the harbor master? No, I am the harbor mistress. My full title is Chief Assistant Shipyard Regulator, Harbor Operations, Melee Island, a division of Inter-Island Transportation Services. Gotcha. Which okay. means? Which means I'm in charge of ship allocations on Melee Island. Baby, you can be in charge of my ships any day of the week. What? Are you trying to seduce a government employee? Uh, no. So, uh, you're in charge of the ships. I'm commandeering a vessel. Not so fast, mister. No boat leaves this harbor without my permission. And I see no reason to give you permission to take one of my boats. Okay. But Stan said I could. Name dropping won't get you a boat. I'm married to the governor. I heard she was dead. Well, she does have her quiet moments, but she's alive and back on melee and ready to govern. Oh, so she's just been on vacation all this time, huh? That's nice. She won't be governor for long. I'm voting for Mr. Charles. He promised me a promotion. Come on, just give me a boat. The rules prohibit the shipyard regulator, that would be me, from lending a boat to anyone who does not have proper authority. That would be you. What would it take to get you to look the other way? <laughs> I really hope that you aren't trying to bribe an employee of the Melee Island government. Not that I care what happens to you, but I really don't want to fill out the paperwork. Uh -huh. Never mind. Now that I can do. All this red tape is giving that, me a headache. Gonna, that don't say I didn't give you anything. Save the mansion. So let's go take that and go back to the mansion. I hate this map. I mean, it's not bad, it's just weird. Hmm. 
Let's try 15, 5.5. Well? As useful as a two-pronged cactus would be, I'd rather not stick one in my pants. Hmm. Not a bad piece of modern art, if I do say so myself. Okay. Now we can go... Hey! Get away from there! Before I pop you one on the head, capiche? Okay. Good. Now stay over there, pencil neck. Pull these out. Hey there, want some more kudu jerky pretzels? Sure. Wow, remind me to thank you later. Well, okay. you could save time and thank me now by not knocking down my house with your massive balls of rock. Sorry, kid. No can do. Now let me eat this in peace. You got balls of rock. Oh, ungrateful. Okay, so now we tinker with it. Now he shoots the ball at the cactus. Hey, and what do you think you're doing? Else can happen? Nothing. I don't know what you're talking about. You totally messed up my catapult. What you trying to do to me? You're killing me over here. Well, guess I'm gonna have to start over at my calibration cactus over there. Get out of my way. I hope this works. I hope it does too. There. It's recalibrated to the cactus. Let's try it. Okay, there goes like good. <laughs> you had an explosion, of course. I can't believe you did that. Guess what? I'm still dead. Uh, don't worry. I'll love you even after rigor mortis sets in. <laughs> We've been gone so long they didn't think I was coming back. So those numb skulls at City Hall declared me dead at sea. What about me? Did they say anything about me? No. Then they decided to sell all my belongings and destroy the mansion. That's terrible. Did they sell any of my stuff? A and the worst part is, <laughs> they've ordered a new election for the office of governor. Hmm, maybe I should run. So far, there's only one candidate. And you know the old slogan, where there's only one candidate, there's only one... Choice. Who are you? The name, Mr. Threepwood, is Charles L. Charles. But you can call me the next governor of Melee Island. I you can't like be him. the governor. I'm the governor. And it's a lifetime term. Well, that's the rub, isn't it? You've been declared dead. So I've heard. How did that happen? Who can say? Uh, perhaps if you'd spent a little more time governing and less time gallivanting all over the Tri-Island area with your pet monkey, the good citizens of Melee wouldn't have come to the mistaken conclusion okay. that you were pushing up the petunias. Wait a second. Was I the pet monkey in that last sentence? Okay, we get it. You're running for governor. But why destroy my mansion? Oh, that. When you died, the mansion became the property of the state. As a favor to me, the that future is, yes. governor of Melee Island, the town elders contracted a demolition firm. That's me. To destroy this outdated bourgeois symbol of the elitist piratocracy. But why? Because the days of pirate princesses ruling from secluded mansions are over, my friend. They are? Indeed they are, lad. If the Melee Island of tomorrow is to prosper, it must be governed by a man of the people. A man unafraid to mingle with the common folk. A man who won't hide in a mansion guarded by vicious piranha poodles. A man like you? Precisely. He makes a lot of sense, Elaine. He never did like those poodles. Uh, guy brush! Well, I've got hands to kiss and babies to shake. Ta! It, it definitely has an interesting look at it. Really? I thought he smelled more like a rotting corpse. I've got another plan. With maybe a hint of oregano. Uh, Die brush! Uh, yes, dear? I'm going back to City Hall to run against Charles. Woohoo! How can I help? Go to Lucre Island to talk to the family lawyers. But why? 
I destroyed the catapult. Yes, dearest, I know. But with that demolition order hanging over the mansion, another catapult could come at any moment. We need the kind of restraining order that only my family lawyers can provide. But I want to come up with clever campaign slogans and do ops research. Guybrush, love of my life, I'm a politician. Let me do what I do best. I'll let you do what you do best. What's that? Sailing around the Tri-Island area on seemingly pointless errands. What? Oh, I'm sorry. Did I say that out loud? What I meant to say was... Venturing into troubled waters on dangerous quests. Well, okay then. That's more like it. Okay. I'm off to start my campaign. <laughs> Don't spend too much time on Luger Island, dearest. Okay.